Well, I would say big use in general uh, is uh, really um, on a growth trajectory, especially yeah. when it comes new energy solutions. I, I would say uh, turbo machinery plays a primary role in that. Um, Welcome to an episode of Strategic Conversations. We host insightful discussions with top business leaders. Today, we are hosting Mr. Marco Cacavale, Vice President Global Sales for Turbo Machinery and Process Solutions with Baker Hughes. Mr. Cacavale will be a speaker at the Houston Strategy Forum's upcoming Global Gas and LNG Symposium. We're excited and looking forward to hosting at the Houston Strategy Forum. Hope you are going to be there to engage with him and have a wonderful discussion with him. I'm Ravi Kathuria, president of the Houston Strategy Forum and author of the management and leadership book, How Cohesive Is Your Company? And author of the book, Happy Soul, Hungry Mind. Strategic Conversations is hosted by the Houston Strategy Forum. If you like these conversations, please hit like and subscribe to the Houston Strategy Forum's YouTube channel. Today's episode is sponsored by Cohegic, my management consulting and executive coaching firm. Thank you for joining us today. And we're looking for an insightful and fun discussion with Mr. Kakawale. Marco, thank you, sir. Thank you for being here today. Thank you for taking the time. Uh, we're excited to, have, to learn from you, sir, and have a great discussion. Ravi, thank you. Thanks for having me today. And I'm glad to be joining you uh, to the panel later on this month. Yes, that is that has turned out to be a powerful panel. And uh, as I have I have done strategic conversations with with the various panelists, I hear different counterpoints. So this is going to be one exciting discussion. This is going to be one spirited uh, discussion. I can't wait uh, to have that discussion unfold. Uh, Thank you, sir. Tell us about your, your division, Turbo Machinery and Process Solutions. And tell us, you know, as in your role, you're, you're head of global sales there, uh, but help us understand uh, what that involves uh, in, in a little bit more detail. Yeah, Ravi, uh, Turbo Machinery and Process Solution is one of the four businesses uh, that co that comprises uh, Becky Hughes uh, of, and uh, it's a highly differentiated equipment and, and full service provider business, which offers uh, energy solutions aimed at sustainability, resilience, and reliability across the portfolio, whether it's the oil and gas, the industrial, or in the energy solution space. We provide compression and power generation okay. capabilities um for every segment like i said of the oil and gas and we have a very strong portfolio uh, both in industrial and in new energy solutions just to give you a sense uh we have experience in treating uh, hydrogen since the the 60s and the, the you know in 1962s oh, wow. uh, and we've built the first ever uh 100 hydrogen turbine uh power plant um uh, in the world um, where is that located it, it's, it's, it's located in Italy uh, okay. and it's, uh, it's, it's, called, it's an Italian uh, power project uh, in Fusina. And when was that town. installed? Uh, it, it was installed in 2008. Okay. Okay. So it's fairly recent project, 10 years, 12 years old. Correct. Correct. And, and we've been for, for a decade uh, now involved in an exposure in various areas of carbon capturing, utilization and storage uh, value chain. There is uh, post combustion capture, compression, subsurface storage, as well as long term integrity and monitoring. So, um, our, um, I think, our forte and what we're here and what we will be in the panel, the panel to talk about is really our strong presence in the natural gas and LNG in particular. Yes. Uh, where we, we are really the top technology partner, uh, particularly in the LNG liquefaction equipment business. Okay. Uh, that helps customers, you know, increase energy efficiency, and uh, um, on most major LNG operations around the world. Um, we also have, you know, a, a, 
you know, an existing technology portfolio uh, apt to detect, monitor, and, and reduce uh, methane emissions. So okay. where we either utilize, you know, gas that otherwise will be flared, yes. uh, we will be detecting repairing leaks or improve uh, flare combustion efficiency or upgrade equipment to reduce venting during ordinary operations. Ah, wonderful. So what is the, the share of revenues of turbo machinery and process? You said it is one of the four business segments at Baker Hughes. Uh, is the revenue uh, a quarter of the total revenues? How does this, or do you have a yeah, it's, it's share it's of the, the revenues? Yeah, it's the second highest. It's the second highest uh, after the oil field services uh, business, it, okay. it ranges between six point five and seven, you know seven billion dollar range. And do you does the, do you as a company and do you as a division uh, see where would this division rank among the four in terms of future growth rate? Well, I would say big use in general uh, is uh, really. Um, on a growth trajectory, especially yeah. when it comes new energy solutions. I, I would say uh, turbo machinery plays a primary role in that. Um, mm -hmm. And by leveraging the, the, the large portfolio, like I said, that we have both in the natural gas, as well as in the hydrogen and in the carbon capturing uh, and sequestration space. So uh, we do um, position ourselves as a service provider, as a full service provider with a very large install base that yes. provides us some long-term services commitment. Just yes. to give you a sense, in the LNG alone, we have install base for over 400 million ton per annum of liquefied, wow. of liquefaction equipment globally. Yes. And we provide ongoing maintenance services and technology upgrades plus related services to extend equipment life, enhance availability and performance, or contribute to reduce emissions. I see. Now, uh, this, this, I, I suspect you would like this question. Uh, share with us, sir, how Baker Hughes has a competitive advantage in especially the gas and LNG space over the other guys. I would say LNG um, is a high stake game. So uh, experience and expertise counts uh, to the square or to the cube. Right? Yes. Okay. And we have 35 years of experience in the LNG business. Yes. We've been executing projects all around the world. We've delivered many firsts in the industry. Yes. Uh, the first floating LNG, the largest floating LNG, the first, the largest and first electric motor driven LNG, the first fully modularized LNG, the largest LNG refrigeration string in the world. Huh. And so that counts. Okay. We have about a hundred, like I said, a hundred train of LNG uh, that has our equipment on it and 400 million ton per annum nameplate capacity. Yes. Uh, track record counts. We have 98% yes. of uh, average availability. And, yes. and we have, we collect five terabytes of data, of operational data a year. Oh, wow. Yeah. Um, all of our turbines are connected to uh, our eye center, which is where we have uh, a set of experts that review the operational data and support our customers in the field to, like I said, improve their, improve life of field or improve life of performance. Um, and uh, increase the sustainability of the business of our customers. So in a nutshell, we have a very wide suite of solutions, both in the asset and in the services business. We yes. have, and all of them are proven. We, we've actually, by, either by experience or by our testing capability, which is the number one ex, you know, testing capability in the world. So our, our customers have the opportunity to pretty much field direct the equipment before it arrives to site.